Hello, I'm Jim Ault. I'm the Director of Environmental Horticulture here at the Botanic Garden. Primarily, I'm the plant breeder here developing new herbaceous perennials, but I'm also responsible for a tissue culture propagation lab, a plant introduction program, as well as other activities like lecturing and teaching. I grew up in Michigan. I can remember a very young age walking through the forest and just having fun, kind of looking at the plants and family vacations for many years. I had a grandmother who worked at Fairchild Botanic Garden down in Florida, and so I was always fascinated when we visited her place because the backyard was full of ferns and other exotic plants that she was growing from spore or from seeds. That had a strong influence as well. When I went off to college at University of Michigan, I knew I was going to major in the sciences one way or the other, and up in botany my junior year. The plant breeding program involves working with the plants when they're in bloom. So on a typical day that I'd be breeding out here, I'll, I'll be out early collecting pollen off the flowers that I'm interested in, and then at various times of the day back out visiting other plants and pollinating the flowers, collecting the seed in the fall, and continuing the process. Plant conservation is important to all of us, whether people are aware of it or not, because of course plants are the basis of life on this planet. People may not think of horticulture as part of conservation research, but the research we're doing in this garden is very much a conservation style. Uh, the urban landscapes that we live in are an environment, and as such we need to take care of that as best we can as well. And so if we can ultimately develop and recommend plants to the public that don't use fertilizers, that we don't need to add pesticides to, that are drought tolerant such that we don't have to water them, uh, that improves the landscapes that we live in.